My name is Clay Robinson. I'm a soil scientist at West Texas A&M University in Canyon. You can call me Dr. Dirks. Hi, Dr. Dirks. Hi, Dr. Dirks. Cool. So we're going to talk about why soil is important to every one of you. We're going to talk about a little bit about what a soil scientist needs to know, and then we're going to take a hike, and we're going to do some of those things. And we're going to see some stuff. We're going to touch some stuff. We're going to smell some stuff. And there's some other secrets in there. And we're going to end up giving you something that you can, you're going to make something you can take home with you, all right? So... All right, so soil is important to you. How many people had lunch? You all had lunch, right? Yeah. Breakfast? Hope you had breakfast, too. I love breakfast burritos. What do you put on the outside of a breakfast burrito? Tortilla. A tortilla. How do you make a tortilla? Well, that's good. Answer. I don't make a tortilla with flour. Do you make it with flour? What do you use to make the flour? From the plant. What, what grain? What, what's the grain? Wheat. That's right. So we take this grain that's wheat that grows on a plant. We, cr we grind it up. And that's how we make the flour. But that plant, where does the plant grow? Farms. Well, on farms, but in the soil, okay? It's not the dirt. The dirt's what's on my hands. The dirt's what's probably on my pants and on my boots because uh, dirt is soil that's out of place. But when it's in place and performing its function, then it's soil. And so we're going to talk about the soil. So where does that plant grow in the soil? All right, that was pathetic. Try again. Where does it go? grow? In the soil. Much better, much better. Okay, now then, um, I, like the, I like the salsa on my burrito, right? So it's got, and that salsa's got tomatoes, chilies, onions, cilantro, things like that that are fruits and, and they grow, those are plants that grow in the soil. And this, I'm going to put some eggs on it. Where do I get eggs? From chicken. chicken. No, from chickens, not pigs. Pigs give us bacon and sausage, right? I hens. <laughs> oh, hens. Okay, hens. All right. From hens, which are chickens. But what do those chickens eat? They eat plants. They eat plants, yeah. Grain, corn, things like that that are plants that grow in the soil. That's right. And then I'm going to put some cheese on it. Where do I get the cheese? From the cows. Well, from the milk that I get from cows. And so then they eat what? Grass. Grass and grains that are plants that grow in the soil. I want you to stand up. All right. Cool. Put your hands on your tummy like this. Right? Because if you don't take care of your soil, there's not going to be food. If there's not any food, you're all going to get very hungry. That's right. Tremendous. Now then, next, you're all wearing clothes. That you get from clothes are made of what fiber? Cotton. cotton. That's right. They're made of cotton. And cotton's a fiber that grows around the seed of a plant. Where does the plant grow? Soil. Oh, so, so, so now then, listen carefully. If you don't take care of your soil first, there is no food. There's no food, you're what? Hungry. Oh, you did it. Somebody always does it. So there's no food, then you're hungry. But now there's no clothes. If there's no clothes, then you're naked. That's right. And then last, yeah. What's inside the walls of your house? Wood. That grows on trees. That grow in the soil. soil. See those bricks? How do you make bricks? Right. You take soil and you take, you make mud out of it and then you shape it and you bake it in a really hot fire. And that's a brick. The concrete we make with some minerals that we mine from soil. You see that building's got rocks that they made with minerals. You know, they pull those, mine those rocks out of the soil. So if we don't take care of the soil first, there's no food. Everybody is hungry. There's no clothes. Everybody is naked. There's no shelter. Everybody is hungry. That's right. And then finally, what, these, what else do these plants give us? Shade. Shade. Oh, oxygen. That's right. We do get some shade from them. But really, oxygen is the important part, right? Because if there's no oxygen, you can't breathe. You can't breathe. You can't talk. So I want you to say, I want you to say breathless like this. That's right. Okay? Because if there's no oxygen, you can't breathe. Right? So you're able to get breath. Okay. So now then, review. Why is it important to take care of the soil? Why is it important to you? Because if you don't, there's no food and you're hungry.